welcome, welcome, welcome to another Deke J. Wilson STEM video. Now this video uh, is um, on using a protractor for a class project and um, it's just a demonstration on some great techniques on using the protractor. Okay, So on this video we are going to create the 90, 60, 30 triangle. Okay, so you, you saw the other triangles that we created for class. Um, those videos are created. This is that, um, that final triangle. Okay, now remember all the angles in a triangle have to add up to 180 degrees. That's just uh, some things to remember. Now with that, I'm just going to go over the protractor a little bit. Remember down here you have the, um, the edge and on this edge you also have an inches ruler. You have your center guideline, which is this black line that goes along the bottom. Then you'll have your center hole. Okay. Then on the inside edge, there is a metric roller. And then on the outside and on the inside, you have your degree markings. Okay. So though is that is the um, the protractor. So one of the things that we're going to do first is we're going to um, and this steps in creating this 90, 60, 30 triangle, we're going to create, actually I'm going to draw just a, a straight line. Okay? Now once I, again, doesn't matter how long that line is, um, I'm going to pick up my protractor, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my protractor down back on that line, but I'm going to match up my guideline on the protractor with that original line that I just drew. Okay? Then once I do that, you know, make sure it lines up. I want to make a tick mark in here, and so I'm going to make my 90 degree angle, okay? And so here's 90 degrees. There's 90, okay? And then what I'm going to do is now I'm going to play connect the dots. I'm going to connect both of those lines. So that is my 90 degree angle. Okay? Then the next thing that I'm going to do is now I'm going to make my 60 degree angle. So I'm going to close my triangle this way. So I'm going to move my protractor over here. I'm going to match up my guideline with that original line that I drew. Okay? I'm going to make a tick mark because that's going to be my starting point. And then I'm going to look over here since I'm closing my triangle. I'm going to look for 60 degrees. There's 60 degrees right there. And guess what we get to do? Absolutely right. We get to connect the dots. So now I'm going to move my protractor. Get a nice straight line. and connect the dots. Okay? So this is my 60 degree angle. And since this is my 60 degree angle, that means this has to be my 30 degrees. Okay? Now, again, remember one of the things that you have to do with triangles or for our project, you have to measure your sides. Okay, and remember your measurements go on the outside of your triangle. Angles go on the inside, measurements go on the outside. Okay, so with that, again, happy protractoring, and uh, again, thanks for watching. If this video helped you out, uh, please subscribe, and um, please be you, you'll uh, get all the new videos once they come out. Okay, again, hashtag go build something cool, and uh, STEM is fun. Thanks for watching.